All right, man. A uh, rumor in the street is that Ryan Garcia could be fighting Tevor Farmer um, April 2nd. So uh, April is supposed to be a big money boxing uh, penciled in because you have uh, – potentially you have Usyk and uh, AJ2 uh, allegedly uh, penciled in as Spence Ugas April 16th. Also, Fury and uh, White could fall in April or, or in May. I mean, then you got Canelo fighting in May um, versus somebody. So, yeah, it could be very interesting. But right now they're saying Ryan Garcia, Tevin Farmer's rumor. Uh, Tevin said he down, you know what I'm saying, to fight Ryan Garcia. He said it sounds good to him. But when the last time Tevin Farmer fought, you know what I'm saying? Like, dude, like, te- the, man, let's just talk about it, man. Check out the box rumor playlist. Uh, we talk about Kovalev. I think that might be official. We just call it a rumor <clears throat> for right now. But, um. Kevin Farmer last fall when you had fans full capacity in the stadium, right? He making a lot of money. You know, he got a YouTube channel where he reinvests his money, all that stuff, buying houses, sit flipping them, renting them out very soon. He don't have to fight. So he ain't fought since 130, 2020. All right. So that's been over. It's going, it's over two, it's going on two years. Well, over two years by the time they fight. Two years, bro. And then, you know, you got to peep what Ryan Garcia doing. The reason why he fight Issa Cruz because, you know, he knew Issa Cruz wasn't a big puncher. It's like I said before, man, these, these dudes are really mercenaries. That's all. And they all they all do it for the, they all just do it for the cash. However they maneuver is for the cash. Not just keep Thurman. All these dudes is mercenary. And they looking for the highest payday for the less risk. Now, he wanted to fight Tevin Farmer. Some people on his team didn't want, I mean, he wanted to fight Issa Cruz. People on his team didn't want to fight Issa Cruz. Didn't matter. He fight Issa Cruz coming off a, a loss, right? Um, you know, and he really ain't no puncher. We seen the verse tank. And Tevin ain't no puncher, man. We can see, we can see right through this, bro. Ryan Garcia has had how many professional fights? Hold on. And he still got the training wheels on it. With the, with the little training wheel hat on and the bike hat on and the knee pads and ankle pads and the neck brace and a bulletproof vest, excuse me, a bulletproof vest, you know, under his damn, you know, under his damn, you know, clothes and stuff, man. Motherfucker got 21 fight, 18, 18 KOs, and he fought once last year. Come on. Why we ain't fighting for a title? You go right over there and spark Gambo, Gamboso, can't you? All the stuff he taught, it's a joke. Then he's going to have the nerve to say Sugar Ray Robinson and Joe Lewis is my favorite fighters on Twitter the other day. Man, man, don't – you ain't even allowed to say them words as a fighter. Hey, man, come on, man. It was real fighters. But it says that uh, – it says Farmer said, I'm excited about getting back in the ring. This is going to be fun if you know uh, – if you know, you know. Farmer man about to get put right back outside the ring. He about to get right outside. He don't have a best chance in hell. Then, nigga, you ain't fought in over two years. At least Ryan ain't fought over a year. He about to get spanked on. We all know that. Or he going to get robbed. Because when I said people down playing Tevin as an opponent for Ryan, they seem to forgot that he was top five junior uh, lightweight when he lost his belt to a current top ten lightweight. And JoJo both were coming off along long layoffs. He said, facts, they must have forgot. I'll remind, I'll remind them at this time around. I won't have literally drained myself to make weight, and I cut the weight the right way. Most people don't see behind the scenes. They only see us on fight night, y'all. will see a new, better version of me. I mean, you got to sell the fight. I tell you to squeeze down to fucking 30. Anybody put a pistol to your head and say, you got to go down to 30? And then you'll see a better. Oh, we see a win. I don't care about you being better. You make me bad. I don't care about that. Will you win? That's the only thing. Will you be will you be competitive, bro? You won't. That's why they putting you in there with Ryan. They about to give you a payday and you about to, you know, get robbed or get knocked out or, or lose. You know, he ain't fought nobody, bro. And you turn around and you fight Jojo Diaz leftovers and then you duck Jojo Diaz before the handy fight. Make this make sense. And these are the type of bird brains, these are the type of douchebags they want me to pay for. 
I, if the zone membership was a dollar, I wouldn't pay a dollar to see that dude fight. Crazy. Crazy. This is the type of crap they want us to pay for. Then he gonna go into hiding for another year and like, why don't just Ryan Garcia retire, bro? He don't want to fight. Dude, Ryan Garcia can have that Camboso fight like that. These dudes don't want to fight. Then when he do fight, man, they got a training wheels, a ankle uh, brace, knee, I mean, ankle little braces. They got an elbow pass, knee pass. He got a bulletproof vest under him. You know what I mean? He got safety shoes, non-slip shoes, trainer wheels on the front, trainer wheels on the back. You know? Fight somebody that matters if you're going to fight once a year. Fight somebody that, that we that's going to be competitive, bro. You fought Luke Campbell, got dropped. You said, ain't doing that no more. Give me feather fisted. Give me somebody you can't punch. No, fuck out of here, man. Come on, man. If you don't want to fight, just retire, bro. Please go model underwear and, and be an influencer. I respect them more than I respect them as a fighter, bro. He can walk right in there and fight Camboso. He can walk right in there and fight Joseph Diaz, even coming off a loss. You don't fight the guy Joseph Diaz beating you. Expect me to be excited about it. Get out of here, man. You can fight Frank Martin, Mich Michelle Rivera. I don't care if you fought a guy like Nakatani or Fortuna or Comey coming off a loss. He ain't getting knocked out. Or Jorge, Jorge Lenare. Way better fights out here than that, bro. Tevin Farmer ain't, ain't moved in how long? That boy was living his best life making money. He about to go in there and be just another statistic. That's what he about to be. He about to go in here and get put to sleep. Or get robbed. Or get battered. That's it. You know, that's why, man, I don't know if the zone renewed Golden Boy contract or not, but they need to have them niggas on the month-by-month -month plan. On a month-by-month -month plan. That nigga need to be, they, they should need to be uh, brought to the board meeting reviewed every month. They ain't got nothing to offer, bro. Put them dudes back on Facebook Watch. That's where they deserve to be at. You don't like black people, all right? You don't like they black fighters, and the, and they couldn't keep Canelo happy, right? You know, and uh, and can't keep Ryan happy. Ryan want to do one thing, they want to do another thing. You know what I'm saying? Come on, without Ryan Garcia, they probably don't even get a new deal with his own. Him fight Tevin Farmer's a joke, bro. They a whole joke. The motherfucker ain't fought in two years. And the guy he lost to is on your pay is on your promotional company. Y'all stable mates. Why you can't fight him? Why you have to go? They always pulling out, man. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, I meant to help on my leg, my shoulder, my toe. Oh, man. Niggas a sissy, bro. We all know that, right? He ain't gonna fight nobody, bro. Ain't gonna fight nobody. Come on, man. And then he fights somebody. He fights somebody that a stable mate lost to. Come on, man. It's crazy. Now some old the weight cut. Now I ain't trying to hear you. You talked all that crap about Joseph Diaz. And then Joseph came in that boy. Ping pong, ping pong, pong. You know, strength out ice on you and, and tow you up. Now it's making the way. Oh, just stay flipping houses. You there as an honorary Negro. That's what you're there for. Honorary Negro for Ryan to beat up on. You know you ain't got no chance in hell to beat Ryan Garcia. No chance. That's what you got. <laughs> Come on, man. Let me move on, bro. Before I, just keep, before I get ignorant. Real ignorant.
apparently Kovalev is coming back versus Fang Long uh, Mang. I don't know much about Fang Long Mang, but it's at a catch weight. And at 185 pounds. So Kovalev ain't fought in how long? Since Canelo. Remember, they sued him for showing the Canelo, streaming Canelo fight or some shit like that on his own. So uh, Fang Long's supposed to have a fight coming up at 225. So I guess that's a wrap. He's 17 and 0, 10 KO. So he ain't lost 33. Uh, he ain't like heavyweight, but he kind of fluctuated in between the weight. But um, it's basically a cruiserweight fight. His nickname is Cold Blooded. He's from China. Shout out to China. Um, and Sergey Kovalev. Damn, last time Kovalev fought. They come to crush you in the crush of crush dogs and women too. Not this boxers. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> yeah, Kovalev ain't fought since 2019, November. So he's been gone for a few years. <laughs> Fang Long, last time he fought was. Uh, Uh, in October, last October, on 29th, he fought in, uh, he fought in Kamisi, Silver Spurs Arena. So, yep, so Kovalev coming back. He come to crush you, boy. Monkey boy. Come here, monkey boy. So, March 12th, LA on Triller. Oh, he coming back on Triller. Oh, they um, what was uh, Rick Ross Triller at Triller? So, yeah, he coming back right in Triller, man. So, I mean, hopefully Fang Long sent him to the shadow around March 12th in L.A. He done with the zone. So, Triller putting on another boxing event. Let me know what you guys think about Ryan, potentially Ryan and uh, Tevin, and what you think about Fang Long Main versus Sergey Kova. Crush your boy Kova left. I crush a monkey. I see Andre Wood, and they say, monkey boy, I crush you. You cheated me. You hit me down below. But, um. Yeah, check out the uh, box Rumor playlist, thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and subscribe button, the bell icon button, hit all notifications, increase your chance to get notifications, reach me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, all my links there, want to support the channel, uh, Cash App, Venmo, CJ Good 313 uh, PayPal link description, appreciate the love and support.